she was always singing. She was always singing. Friends and family say a woman was doing just that and dancing moments before she was hit and killed trying to cross the street. This is Coin 6 News at 4 o'clock. I'm Jennifer Hoff. And I'm Dan Tilkun, and we brought this to you as breaking news last night. Friends tell us the woman was dancing and singing at a nearby Mexican restaurant where she was visiting an employee. And then as she headed home about 5 o'clock yesterday, she got hit by a pickup truck near Malala Avenue and Pearl Street. Our Amy Frazier is going beyond the headlines now live in Oregon City and people are really paying their respects there for her tonight. Amy. Yeah, friends and neighbors have been coming by here all day to leave flowers. You can see this growing memorial off in the distance behind me. They tell me the victim was always happy and yesterday was no different. Today, her husband gave us permission to share her name and photo. She is 52 year old Josie Rojas. We're told she stopped by Lancheria Mitzel restaurant to check on a friend who recently returned to work after having a broken leg. Sometimes she also helped out at the restaurant clearing tables. More than anything, she loved to sing, and that's exactly what she did Wednesday afternoon as the staff at the restaurant got ready to open. In fact, they took cell phone video of her happy performance. A short time later, she left with her Bible in hand and walked on the sidewalk to a nearby intersection. Witnesses tell us she waited for the signal and then started to cross. She died at the scene after being hit by the driver of a pickup truck. Her friend asked not to be on camera, but she says she'll miss Josie's smile. And I would tell her, I want to be happy like you sometimes, you know, because she's always happy. That's always her singing. She was always singing. Oregon City Police say the driver stopped and is cooperating with the investigation. However, they're still looking into exactly how the crash happened. Back here live, we're told the victim was a cancer survivor and leaves behind two children. Reporting live in Oregon City, Amy Frazier, Coin 6 News.